mistaken. We are here with King Meech. I am the Nerd Wife. We're also here with a few competitors from the CSGO tournament. Why don't you all introduce yourselves? Uh, I'm Trident. I'm Stranger. Hey guys, my name is Techie. Awesome. Well, why don't you tell us a little bit about how the tournament went for you? It, it was rough losing and getting knocked out early, but I mean, for a last minute squad, we got third place, which is not bad for a team that was put together like a day before the tournament. Uh, there's a lot of things we need to work on as a team, but we're going to try to get those figured out and situated, taken now, care of. How long have you guys been in existence as a team? And you got third place. Yeah. That's not something that's that bad. You should be proud of that. That's really kind of great. Now, just what would have happened if you guys were to actually practice with a sustainable amount of weeks and stuff? You guys would be amazing. To me, I honestly doubt that. Really? What makes you say that? Uh, because me and another player on our team um, uh, had more, a little bit more experience, a little bit more um, uh, game time and game time. Well, these guys, like, they, they've been playing more other games that haven't really took the time into practicing specific aspects of the game. So th th they were struggling out of some parts, but as a team, we still like we still like held up together. You know, still called out. We all knew what we were doing at the same time, but uh, there are still yeah. Again, like he said, we still some, there are still things we need to work on. But hopefully, we can keep this lineup right here, make some changes maybe. But yeah, hopefully next year we'll have a better run. I agree with that. Well, what advice do you have for anyone who might want to improve their CS:GO game? Uh, I say just go for it. Practice a lot. Keep a consistent, it's all about dedication, really. Just keep a consistent schedule playing and finding teammates you get along well with and you play well together with. Awesome, I guess compatibility is probably really important here. <laughs> I noticed that you have a little something in your hands here. What, 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 what do we have here? What I like to call it is like a tiny guitar. Even though I know it's called a ukulele, but I, I just picked it up less than a year ago, and I can already sight-read music. That's really impressive. That's not an easy feat. Would you like to share a little bit of your music with us? Uh, what do you want to hear? Something nerdy, something video gamey. Do you got anything like that? Yeah. All right, play something <laughs> cool, whatever you want. Yeah. Your favorite, whatever, whatever your favorite you. is. You just do it. I'll just play, like, um, a beginning of a song, and maybe you'll recognize it. OK, well, we'll make a game out of it. I liked what I heard, but I, I, I'm really dumb, so I don't recognize beautiful. a lot of things. Yeah, so, so tell, now tell me, what is it from? Uh, it's I'll Follow You Into the Dark, Death Cab by Cutie. Death Cab. That's Good sick. Call. Okay, Good respect. Well, guys, we have some talent talented. here at the Level Up Expo. All right, guys, well, thank you for joining us, and yeah, uh, we, we hope you continue you to here. enjoy the Level Up Expo. Thank you for having us. Thank you, my friend. And uh, if you guys, uh, guys want to plug anything, you want to go ahead and do that, now's the time. I got nothing. <laughs> Uh, no, follow me, not your dreams, at Stranger, um, S-T-R-R-A-N-G-E-R on Twitch. Hey guys, All my right. name is Techie, Twitch not underscore Techie. I'm so close to affiliate, if you just watch my channel, then that'll be great. We can have some fun, we can have to play some games together. Sorry about that. Watch the man. Oh yeah, alright, spread that, spread that GL love you all, give him a follow. Thank you all so much for coming by. Thank you guys, have a good one. Do you want to spin the wheel? He wants to spin the wheel. Spin the wheel, right. my friends. So, guys, the wheel of sadistic torture is back, and we're going to let our friends here spin. Go ahead, my friend, all you. What do we got? Oh, I got to do Ooh, that. Ooh, a cosplayer. a cosplayer. So, you need to find somebody out here that you think is remotely attractive or not. And you have to attempt to woo them. I'm talking maybe a kiss on the hand, maybe even a hug, maybe a little tossle of the hair. Anybody that you're seeing that you'd like to... What about Spider-Man? Right over here. Hold on, guys. This is going to be great. Oh, he just assaulted him okay. from behind. So, 
Folks, you're not seeing this, but the gentleman that was just standing next to me is now assaulting Spider-Man. Yeah. You heard it. Uh, he's Ah, there he is. He's running away now. Spider-Man uh, Spider is Spider clearly is choked up. A little uh, stuck. He doesn't know what to think or expect. Right. He's clearly distraught. <laughs> wow. That was like a lion attacking a wildebeest. Seriously, wonderfully. I love how it said, woo a cosplayer, and you took that as, you know what, I'm going to take advantage of that guy right now. Yes. And I appreciate that. That's the kind of drive and commitment you see here at the Level Expo, Expo right here. There's what a fine line between woo and assault. I'm, I'm and, uh, a little bit tired. I kind of hurt my feet jumping off there. <laughs> All right. Well, thank you again, guys. That was magnificent. Wasn't expecting it. You're a champion. You guys enjoy the rest of your day. Yes. Thank you, man. Appreciate you.